When it comes to owning a dog, there are many factors to consider, one of the most important being safety. You want to make sure that your pup is well trained and won't cause any trouble. One important factor in assessing a dog's safety is the size and strength of its bite. In this video, we will compare the bite forces of two commonly feared dogs. The pit bull and the rottweiler. So why does this matter? Well, if you're ever unfortunate enough to be on the receiving end of either breed's bite, you'll definitely want to know which one is more likely to do more damage. And if you're a dog owner, it's important to know which breed is more likely to cause serious injury if they ever get into a fight with another dog. But before we continue into the subject, please subscribe and like our video. It's a fact that both pit bulls and rottweilers bite force are known for their strength and power. And both have been used extensively in law enforcement and military work. But which of the two has a stronger bite force? The pit bull? Or, is it the Rottweiler? Pit bulls were bred to be aggressive and violent. They are energetic and athletic dogs that were originally raised for fighting and they still have those tendencies today. Pit bulls are also more likely to attack and bite than Rottweilers. But you must remember that both breeds can be dangerous if they are not properly trained and socialized. Aggression is not inherent in all pit bulls, and many of them make wonderful, loving family pets. Although pit bulls have earned a reputation as aggressive dogs, in reality, they can be quite gentle when raised in a supportive environment. Now, what about the bite force of the pit bull? According to a study conducted by Dr. Brady Barr of National Geographic, the pit bull has a bite force of 235 psi. This is because of their strong jaw and muscular build. And their bite force comes close to that of other muscular breeds like German Shepherds and Boxers. Although this bite force isn't particularly impressive compared to some other breeds, it should not be underestimated. Pit bulls have been known to inflict serious injuries on humans if provoked or attacked. So, if you have become a victim of this warrior animal, immediately take yourself to the closest emergency room for urgent attention. The Rottweiler's Bite Force Rottweilers are another popular breed known for their strength and loyalty. They were originally bred in Germany as working dogs, and their intimidating size, powerful build, and strong jaws, make them excellent guard dogs. Rottweilers have a very high bite force compared to other dog breeds, which is why they are often used in law enforcement and security work. However, their strong jaws can also be dangerous, especially if they are not properly trained and socialized from a young age to ensure that they do not become aggressive or territorial. With an average bite force of 328 psi that can easily crush bones, Rottweilers have considerably more power behind their jaws than pit bulls do. That means that the Rottweiler's bite force is nearly 40% stronger than the bite force of a pit bull and much higher than the average dog's bite force of around 200 psi. Interestingly, the Rottweiler's bite force is influenced by its enormous head. With such strong jaw power, they can exert a lot of pressure with their jaws, and cause serious damage if they bite someone. So, it's important for owners of Rottweilers to make sure that their pup is well trained and socialized from a young age so that they're able to handle themselves properly in any given situation. Of course, it's important to remember that these numbers are just averages. There will always be individual dogs who fall outside of the norm. But overall, the Rottweiler is clearly the winner over the pit bull when it comes to bite force. What's important is for owners of these breeds to ensure that their pup receives proper care and training at all times. Just remember, neither breed should be considered inherently dangerous. Both pit bulls and Rottweilers can make great pets if they're raised properly. That way you can protect yourself and your beloved pet from any potential danger. Thanks for watching our video. Please comment, like, and subscribe for more content about your beloved pets.